Hello and greetings. On this video, I'll show how you install and set up a uh, Leechy photo management software. Um, hopefully I'm, I'm pronouncing it right. Leechy would be L-Y-C-H-E-E. -E. So let's go ahead and jump in. I'm gonna try to do all this on Windows, so just to make it easier for everybody. Uh, so here I have a Windows 10 computer running. And the first thing I'm going to do is open my browser. So we're going to keep it there. Let me go ahead and, and zoom in. Yeah, that's, that's pretty good. And we're going to search for Leechy Photo Management. And it should be like the first thing. Oh, I misspelled it. So, But anyways, it's still right here. Uh, see, Leechy self-hosted photo management done right. Click on that. And towards the bottom, you can see it's pretty polished and pretty nice. Um, you're going to go find where it says C, C on GitHub. Click on that. And then you're going to go here where it says on the green area where it says clone or download. Click on that. Okay, download zip. And you can see it's download. Let me zoom out a little bit. So you can see it's downloading. It's already done actually downloading. The file is pretty tiny. So next what we're going to do is open our file manager. And here we're going to go to downloads. So let me zoom in so we can find it. And here it is right here. See Leechy Manage Master. Right click to that and extract all. Don't, don't try to get it from within. You need to extract it. That's the best way to do it. You want the files to actually be manageable. Okay, so now you can see here are the actual files. Excuse me. Here they go. So what we are going to do now is, let me zoom out, is we are actually going to start our, file, our FileZilla or whatever uh, F, FTP client you have. Uh, for mine, I, I use FileZilla, so I'm going to go ahead and search for it, and here it is. So here's my FileZilla. So what I'm going to do here, uh, I'm trying to, yeah, that's cool. So let me just zoom in to this a little bit, and then my pass, password. Hit enter, and it should log you right in. So I'm going to go under web. And here I'm going to create a new directory or a new folder. I'm going to right click to that, create new directory, and I'm going to call that Leechy. Okay, just to keep it consistent. So now I have the folder here. Now what I'm going to do on the left side, I'm going to navigate to my download folder and to this Leechy master. Remember that that's where I extracted. So on the right hand side, I'm going to go to here to the Leechy. So I'm actually in the directory or in the folder. From the left side, I'm going to copy everything and drag it to the right. And all, all that's getting transferred over. And that's basically all you're, you're going to do from this part. So I'm going to go ahead and disconnect. So I, I can actually just close it. And now I'm going to navigate to the actual website. Okay, so once you open your browser, what, what you'll do is you'll navigate to whatever site you loaded, um, all the files and folders. On my case, it's going to be under leechy.localsite.net. Okay, so once you're greeted by this bot, by this uh, window, you're in the right path. See where it says here, optional under database host. Um, it's if you're being hosted, if you have it hosted by someone else, definitely uh, input the host database server. So on mine, uh, I'm gonna do local host. I'd rather be in the safe site. It's just something to, to type in. The username for my site is going to be C12. My database password 
we'll go ahead and enter it. And then the database name on my side is going to be C1 Lychee DB. Okay, so if you have entered these four things, either that you created yourself or that were given to you by your host provider, then go ahead and click on connect. If everything won't work well, then you're going to be greeted by this to set up a, a username and a password. I'm going to go ahead and set up local admin and my password. Press enter. Now you're actually greeted by the actual server. You're logged in. You have the gear up, up here on the upper left. You can see even diagnostics and so forth. Uh, now on the right hand side, you have a plus where you could actually add your photos or you could also import them uh, to the server. And um, yeah, but that's basically how you get this machine up and running. All that good jazz, subscribe, thumbs up, and I'll definitely see you on the next one. Thanks a lot.